Well, after most people head to bed, Karen Grunewald and her volunteer crew are up and headed to the center in, Br in Brainerd to whip up more than just a midnight snack. For this week's Community Spotlight, Mel Meyer stopped by their kitchen to see why they work overnight to bake thousands of donuts each week. It's just after midnight. I'm someone that doesn't require a whole lot of sleep. And it's a perfect time to start making these delicious donuts. I'm doing blueberry right now. Every Thursday morning, volunteers work quickly. When they're hot, the sugar sticks to them. Always moving to fill the online and over the phone orders. How many orders I have? 240 dozen today. That's a small day. You've got the loyal standing orders. Those motors, they get a standing order of 15 dozen every week. And the loyal but varying walk-ins. We don't know how many walk-ins we're going to get. It's one of the hardest parts on nights like these. You never know if you're going to make enough or if you made too much. But if they do, someone is sure to eat them. During the week, we keep them in the freezer and take hold out how many we need for the day and warm them up, nuke them, and it's like fresh ones again. So what is it exactly that makes these donuts so special? They're made by old people. <laughs> there you go. It's really about the people behind the counter. It's why they've been pulling the all-nighters for years. Just getting together with the people that work here, you know. And uh, if they're all crazy enough to get up early and get going, then <laughs> it's all right with me. The most gratifying part has to be seeing them get done and eating them. <laughs> and people certainly love to eat them. People said that's the way to get people to a meeting is to come and get uh, the donuts from the center. Even customers like Andrew Doucette, who started getting these from his grandma when he was a kid, still enjoys them once a week. I try to get here every Thursday for the guys at work. We like to have these on break time. They're the best donuts around a family tradition that so many enjoy. I think it's just kind of a tradition in the morning and it's fun for the kids. We just come and get our donut and have a little time before school. Even if it takes all night, being able to create memories that last a lifetime, for these volunteers, that's time well spent. In Brainerd with this week's Community Spotlight, I'm Mal Meyer, Lakeland News. And if you think you have what it takes to help out, the center says they're always looking for additional volunteers. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.